Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how I do Nala's hair, specifically her coconut oil conditioning treatment. As you can probably tell, Nala has a lot of hair in her head, but it tends to get dry and tangly, especially when she sleeps. Using this coconut oil conditioning method helps to keep your hair soft, shiny, and her curls nice and bouncy. So if you want to see how I do it, just keep watching. So all you really need for this is virgin coconut oil, comb, and a baby shampoo. I'll show you the baby shampoo I use a little later on in the video. For Nala's baths, I use the Four Moms Infant Thermometer Tub. I really love this because it has a thermometer built in, so it tells me if the water is too hot or too cold. It always allows me to keep the temperature just right for Nala. She's actually about to outgrow it. She is so tall. Okay, so the first thing I do is wet Nala all over her body and her hair just so when I apply the coconut oil, it can move through it a little bit easier. And one of my tips for this is to give your baby something to play with. They can be a little impatient, so something to distract them with can help this process to be a lot more enjoyable. Okay, so now I'm taking about, I would say a teaspoon amount of coconut oil, and I'm applying it from her root to her tips. I like to make sure I massage it too a little bit, just to make sure her scalp is moisturized as well. Then whatever is left on my hands, I like to massage into her skin. Okay, so I just start by working in sections so it's just a little bit easier to manage. I take the comb and then detangle from the tip of her hair all the way to the root. And since the coconut oil has been applied, it makes it a lot easier to detangle. Um, it gives it a little bit of a slip. And you probably can't tell, but I'm holding her hair quite loose from where my finger grips it, so it's not pulling on her scalp. So don't worry, I am being extremely gentle. And now look at how it is when I detangle it. Nice, soft, and smooth. I absolutely love coconut oil hair. So I do this all over the rest of her hair. The back usually takes me the most time because of how she sleeps, it gets knottier there, but the front is basically like 30 seconds. I run it through pretty easily. So now I let the coconut oil sit in her hair while I bathe her. It allows it to really penetrate into her hair. So after I wash and bathe her skin, I go in with Aveeno Baby. It's a multi-wash and shampoo and basically wash out the coconut oil. So this actually takes out the surface level of coconut oil. It doesn't remove it completely, but it leaves enough that it's still moisturized and shiny without being oily or greasy. Now it's time to wash it out and at this point I have to reintroduce the toys to distract her with because she really does not like the feeling of water like running down her neck or face. So I have to do this very quickly. <laughs> Afterwards, I like to dry it with a t-shirt. Just like my hair, I find when I use towels, it makes her curls a little bit frizzy. So I just kind of like to squeeze out the excess water and just kind of let her ear dry on its own, to be honest. So right now, her hair is like 50% dry, but as you can see, it is so smooth, the tangles, shiny, the curls are nice and lush. Coconut oil works wonders on my baby's hair. <laughs> And now this is it, 100% air dried. I just kind of fluffed it out and put a little clip at the top to keep the hair out of her forehead because that bothers her sometimes. Um, but she's happy, it looks nice, it's soft, it's moisturized, and she's happy, the most important part. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Leave any comments or questions down below, and I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Bye.